The Profence PF-M134 minigun is as technically advanced as it gets, assures the creators of this minigun. The weapon delivers about 3,000 rounds per minute, a parameter flexibly adjusted by a digital control unit. It has an effective fire range of 3,600 feet and can be mounted on ground, water and air vehicles, including drones. The minigun is designed to fire 7.62 NATO cartridges and utilizes M13 Link ammunition system. One of the most noticeable features of the weapon is its unusual cooling system. It's located at the front of the gun and is known as the aero clamp. According to the designers, the system reduces the heating of the barrels during firing by about 25%. This submachine gun was developed in 2006 by US specialists, using patents held by French gun designer Renaud Kerbrat. An important feature of this weapon is the Chris Super V system, which is an articulated mechanism with a semi-automatic bolt. It provides high accuracy and control while firing. The submachine gun is available in several versions. The smallest one weighs 5.5 pounds. It has a target range of 148 feet. You can use 9x19mm Parabellum, 45 ACP, 40 S&W, 357 SIGs and 10mm Auto cartridges. The trick is that the caliber can be changed without special tools, literally in seconds. All you have to do is remove three pins. Next in line is a Russian-made sniper rifle. It holds the title of the world's longest-range rifle. In 2017, it hit a target at a distance of 13,812 feet. It also held records for six years at ranges well beyond 6,500 feet. The rifle uses 408 Cheyenne tactical ammunition and is made single-shot for better stiffness and for several other reasons. The design uses Kevlar, aircraft-grade aluminium and high-alloy steel. The rifle weighs 21 pounds and has a 35.5-inch barrel length. This pistol was developed by Italian gunsmiths from Arsenal Firearms. The key feature of this pistol is the two different caliber barrels, and it specified that it's the first semi-automatic pistol of this type in the world. It fires 45 ACP and 38 Super Auto ammunition. Two twin magazines with eight rounds each are used. The gun fires two bullets per trigger pull. It's noted that the best accuracy is reached at the distance of 145 feet. The company believes that their development offers endless combinations of uses. The kit is also supposed to include a special holster made of specific alloys and carbon fibers. Its design, the engineers promised, maximizes the operability of the gun under any circumstance. Why do you think the shape of this semi-automatic pistol is so unusual? It's not hard to guess. The pistol is equipped with a super capacious 50-round magazine. It was designed by the American company Keltec, which specializes in the design and manufacture of firearms. Unlike its competitors, this model has 57 by 28 mm rounds placed horizontally. The magazine was borrowed from a Belgian FN Herstal P90 submachine gun, and the set includes two magazines. The gun without ammunition weighs 3 pounds and has a 9.5 inch barrel. The trigger safety and magazine release latch can be placed on the left or right side for added convenience. A QD slot and Picatinny rail are also provided. Another development from Russia, the ADS Amphibious Rifle. This weapon for naval special forces is a fully-fledged grenade launcher system, created with the aim of reducing the weight of the combat equipment. The weapon has a bullpup design and weighs 10 pounds with the grenade launcher. 
As the name implies, it operates in two environments. Standard 5.45 by 39mm rounds are used on land, and 5.45 PSP rounds are used underwater. The integrated 40mm underbarrel grenade launcher works with VOG 25 type grenades. In addition to these standard options, there are many add ons. For example, silencers can be installed. There's also a Picatinny rail, which guarantees compatibility with a wide range of scopes. A branch of the Brazilian company Forjas Taurus decided to delight pocket pistol connoisseurs. This semi-automatic pistol was first shown at an exhibition back in 2014, and even then it aroused great interest. Visually, the model is interesting because of its curved shape. It follows the contour of the hip, which makes it very convenient for concealed carry. The pistol holds seven rounds of 380 ACP ammunition, and it also features a flashlight and a laser sight. The weapon weighs only 10 ounces without ammunition, and is no more than 5.2 inches long. This is an ultra-comfortable, ultra-reliable personal defense handgun, the company concludes. Here is a product by the world-famous Smith & Wesson, a 5-shot S&W Magnum 500 caliber revolver. It was designed for hunting large animals, such as grizzly bears, and was positioned as the most powerful pistol in the world. This revolver has been in production since 2003, and several modifications are available to customers. It has even been used at sporting events, such as the 2014 African Games. The weight of the weapon ranges from 3.5 to 5 pounds, and its barrel length is 7.5 inches. The recoil is so powerful that Ronald Lee Ermey, a host of military and gun shows, once compared it to a punch from Mike Tyson. Let's move on to a development from the specialists of the Israeli company IWI. Its key features are versatility and reliability. The assault rifle Arad is suitable for both left- and right-handed shooters, and the barrel can withstand about 20,000 rounds. The rifle can be used in a variety of scenarios. Thanks to its modular design, particularly the quick detachable barrel, you can use a wide variety of cartridges, from 5.56 by 45mm to 300 BLK. The basic version is designed for 5.56x45mm 5 5 rounds. It weighs about 6.3 pounds and shoots up to 1100 rounds per minute. Any NATO or MIL STD 5.56 5 magazines can be used, including those made of polymer. Reliability is ensured by the short stroke gas operated action system. There you have it. This grenade launcher was developed back in the early 1980s by a company from South Africa. The weapon proved to be very successful. Later on, licensed copies were produced in Croatia, Bulgaria, China, and the United States. More than 50,000 copies were produced. The grenade launcher is of interest due to its revolver-type design, which allows 12 to 15 rounds per minute with a range of 1,300 feet. It also allows you to fire the same grenade again if it misfires. The weapon is 40mm caliber and is suitable for firing NATO 40x46mm LV ammunition. These include smoke and tear variants. Milcor has also created a twin grenade launcher system, specifically for mounting on vehicles and boats. In 2006, Smith & Wesson wanted to expand its line of shotguns. However, the company itself didn't make them. They were produced by the Turkish company Utas. That company was entrusted with the development of this new rifle. After a couple of years, it became clear that for various reasons, Smith & Wesson could not sell the gun under its own brand. However, the Turkish company did not give up on the project 
and in 2011 introduced the Urban Tactical Shotgun UTS-15. The shotgun without ammunition weighs 6.2 pounds. It's a pump-action shotgun and is equipped with two tubular magazines. Each magazine holds seven 12x70mm rounds, or six 12x76mm rounds. Ammunition can be fed in one of three modes, only from the right magazine, from both magazines alternately, or only from the left magazine. There is a special switch on the receiver to select the mode. Interestingly, opinions were divided. Some liked the shotgun, while others called it, to put it mildly, unsuccessful. What do you think? The AR-15 rifle has been in production since 1963, but is still being upgraded. The new version, known as the XAR Invicta, was presented by the American company F&D Defense, and the main feature is its folding design. One of the features of all AR-15 rifles is the buffer tube concealed within the stock, which makes a folding design impossible. But F&D Defense engineers solved it in a simple way. They folded the barrel, not the buttstock. Thanks to the special loop, it takes about five seconds to put the rifle into firing position. The company say that the rifle maintains zero no matter how many times it's been stowed and deployed. The rifle is designed to work with 5.56 by 45mm ammo and comes with 14.5 inch and 16 inch barrels. The shorter model weighs about 6.2 pounds. We invented something the world didn't have before an integrally suppressed 9mm pistol, claims the American Silencer Co. Collective. The development resembles something out of a sci-fi movie, and it's interesting, if only because it's the first weapon that fits in a holster with a silencer fitted. The gun is approximately 11 inches long, and can be made shorter by removing a few silencer modules. The weight of the gun is a little over 2.5 pounds, and you'll need 9x19mm ammunition for shooting. The magazine fits 17 rounds. The creators point out that any Glock pistol magazines with 17 rounds capacity will do, and there's a special polymer holster for carrying it.